Introduction Welcome to the instruction video for Traceba Flex Touch Pen. Please pay attention to this information before you start using your pen. Do not share your Traceba Flex Touch Pen with other people. Even if the needle is changed, you may give other people a serious infection or get a serious infection from them. Traceba Flex Touch Pen 100 units per milliliter generally referred to as just pen in this video, is a pre-filled, disposable, single-patient-use insulin pen containing 300 units of insulin degludec. You can inject from 1 to 80 units in a single injection. The units can be increased by one unit at a time. This pen is not recommended for use by the blind or visually impaired without the assistance of a person trained in the proper use of the product. To give your Traceba injection, you will need the following supplies. A Traceba Flex Touch Pen, a new Novo Fine Needle, an alcohol swab, and a sharps container for throwing away used pens and needles. See after your injection at the end of these instructions. Start by getting to know the different parts of your pen and needle. This is the pen cap, the insulin scale, the insulin window where you can see the insulin. This is the dose counter and dose pointer. Here's the dose selector, and this is the dose button. This is the Novo Fine needle, and this is the Novo Fine Plus needle. This is the outer needle cap, the inner needle cap, the needle, and the paper tab. Now you are ready to go through the steps for how to inject insulin with your Traceba Flex Touch Pen. Preparing your Traceba Flex Touch Pen. Wash your hands with soap and water. Before you start to prepare your injection, check the Traceba Flex Touch Pen label to make sure you are taking the right type of insulin. This is especially important if you take more than one type of insulin. Traceba should look clear and colorless. Do not use Traceba if it is cloudy or colored. Do not use Traceba past the expiration date printed on the label or 56 days after you start using the pen. Always use a new needle for each injection to help ensure sterility and prevent blocked needles. Do not reuse or share needles with another person. You may give other people a serious infection or get a serious infection from them. Pull the pen cap straight off. Check the liquid in the pen. Traceba should look clear and colorless. Do not use it if it looks cloudy or colored. Select a new needle. Pull off the paper tab from the outer needle cap. Push the capped needle straight onto the pen and twist the needle on until it is tight. Pull off the outer needle cap. Do not throw it away. Pull off the inner needle cap and throw it away. Priming your Traceba Flex Touch Pen. Turn the dose selector to select two units. Hold the pen with the needle pointing up. Tap the top of the pen gently a few times to let any air bubbles rise to the top. Hold the pen with the needle pointing up. Press and hold in the dose button until the dose counter shows zero. The zero must line up with the dose pointer. A drop of insulin should be seen at the needle tip. If you do not see a drop of insulin, repeat this priming procedure no more than six times. If you still do not see a drop of insulin, change the needle and repeat the priming procedure once more. Selecting your dose. Traceba Flex Touch Pen 100 units per milliliter is made to deliver the number of insulin units that your healthcare provider prescribed. Do not perform any dose conversion. Check to make sure the dose selector is set at zero. Turn the dose selector to select the number of units you need to inject. The dose pointer should line up with your dose. In this example, five units are selected. If you select the wrong dose, you can turn the dose selector forwards or backwards to the correct dose. 
In this example, 24 units are selected. The even numbers are printed on the dial. The odd numbers are shown as lines. The Traceba Flex Touch Pen Insulin Scale will show you how much insulin is left in your pen. To see how much insulin is left in your Traceba Flex Touch Pen, turn the dose selector until it stops. The dose counter will line up with the number of units of insulin that is left in your pen. If the dose counter shows 80, there are at least 80 units left in your pen. If the dose counter shows less than 80, the number shown in the dose counter is the number of units left in your pen. In this example, there are only 52 units left, so the dose counter stops and you can't dial past 52 units. Giving your injection. Inject your Traceba exactly as your healthcare provider has shown you. Your healthcare provider should tell you if you need to pinch the skin before injecting. Traceba can be injected under the skin, subcutaneously, of your upper legs, thighs, upper arms, or stomach area, abdomen. Change, rotate your injection sites within the area you choose for each dose. Do not use the same injection site for each injection. Choose your injection site, thighs, upper arms, or abdomen, and wipe the skin with an alcohol swab. Let the injection site dry before you inject your dose. Insert the needle into your skin. Make sure you can see the dose counter. Do not cover it with your fingers. This can stop your injection. Press and hold down the dose button until the dose counter shows zero. The zero must line up with the dose pointer. You may then hear or feel a click. Keep the needle in your skin after the dose counter has returned to zero and slowly count to six. Count slowly. One, two, three, four, five, six. When the dose counter returns to zero, you will not get your full dose until six seconds later. If the needle is removed before you count to six, you may see a stream of insulin coming from the needle tip. If you see a stream of insulin coming from the needle tip, you will not get your full dose. If this happens, you should check your blood sugar levels more often because you may need more insulin. Pull the needle out of your skin. If you see blood after you take the needle out of your skin, press the injection site lightly with a piece of gauze or an alcohol swab. Do not rub the area. Carefully remove the needle from the pen and throw it away. Do not recap the needle. Recapping the needle can lead to needle stick injury. If you do not have a sharps container, carefully slip the needle into the outer needle cap. Safely remove the needle and throw it away as soon as you can. Do not store the pen with the needle attached. Storing without the needle attached helps prevent leaking, blocking of the needle, and air from entering the pen. Replace the pen cap by pushing it straight on. After your injection, the used Traceba Flex Touch Pen may be thrown away in your household trash after you have removed the needle. Put your used needles in an FDA cleared sharps disposal container right away after use. Do not throw away, dispose of loose needles in your household trash. If you do not have an FDA-cleared Sharps disposal container, you may use a household container that is made of a heavy-duty plastic, can be closed with a tight-fitting, puncture-resistant lid without Sharps being able to come out, upright and stable during use, leak-resistant, properly labeled to warn of hazardous waste inside the container. When your Sharps disposal container is almost full, you will need to follow your community guidelines for the right way to dispose of your Sharps disposal container. There may be state or local laws about how you should throw away used needles and syringes. Do not reuse or share needles or syringes with another person. 
For more information about the Safe Sharps disposal and for specific information about Sharps disposal in the state that you live in, go to the FDA's website at http colon slash slash www.fda.gov slash safe sharps disposal. Do not dispose of your used sharps disposal container in your household trash unless your community guidelines permit this. Do not recycle your used sharps disposal container. How should I store my Traceba Flex Touch Pen? Before use, Store unused Traceba Flex Touch pens in the refrigerator at 36 to 46 degrees Fahrenheit, 2 to 8 degrees Celsius. Do not freeze Traceba. Do not use Traceba if it has been frozen. Unused pens may be used until the expiration date printed on the label if kept in the refrigerator. Pen in use. Store the pen you are currently using in the refrigerator between 36 to 46 degrees Fahrenheit, 2 to 8 degrees Celsius, or keep at room temperature up to 86 degrees Fahrenheit, 30 degrees Celsius. Keep Traceba away from heat or light. The Traceba Flex Touch pen you are using should be thrown away after 56 days if it is refrigerated or kept at room temperature even if it still has insulin left in it and the expiration date has not passed. General information about the safe and effective use of Traceba. Keep Traceba Flex Touch pens and needles out of the reach of children. Always use a new needle for each injection. Do not share Traceba Flex Touch pens or needles with other people. You may give other people a serious infection or get a serious infection from them. Summarizing the important steps. To summarize how to use Traceba Flex Touch, these are the important steps. Always use a new needle for each injection to help ensure sterility and prevent blocked needles. Do not reuse or share needles with another person. You may give other people a serious infection or get a serious infection from them. A drop of insulin should be seen at the needle tip when you prime your pen. If you do not see a drop of insulin, repeat the priming procedure no more than six times. If you still do not see a drop of insulin, change the needle and repeat the priming procedure once more. Turn the dose selector to select the number of units you need to inject. Press and hold down the dose button until the dose counter shows zero. Keep the needle in your skin after the dose counter has returned to zero and slowly count to six. When the dose counter returns to zero, you will not get your full dose until six seconds later. Carefully remove the needle from the pen and throw it away. Do not recap the needle. Recapping the needle can lead to needle stick injury. Thank you for watching the instruction video for Traceba Flex Touch Pen.